All right, how's it going? Welcome. This was a highly requested video that you guys wanted me to make, which is, you know, the tutorial on how to install Marvel Spider-Man PC mods. So the reason why I have this game up on the screen right now is to show you that I don't have any modifications right now. So I've got the base suit here, which is the Far From Home suit. Uh, this is the one that I'm going to be installing a mod for today. Um, so you can see here, you know, I've just got all the normal suits, you know, no mods or anything like that, no graphical mods. So now we're going to get on to the tutorial. So let's do this. Okay, so there's quite a few different things you have to do first. And the way you're able to mod this game is by getting the modding tool. And where you get the modding tool is you join the official modding Discord. So I'm going to have the link in the description to the Spider-Man PS4 and PC modding group. And here, you know, first of all, you're going to have to verify yourself and react to roles. So then you can get access to the downloads. Okay. And then you're going to go down here and you're going to download this latest one. Okay. Uh, so Jedi Josh posted this one, uh, Spider-Man PC tool version 1.1.1. .1. That's the latest one. The reason why I haven't made this video is because we've got quite a few different versions. So I just wanted to wait and make sure that we've got the correct one. Okay. So now that we, you've done that, you're going to click download. Okay. And once you download it, you're going to get the zip file. So download Vinrar if you have it or 7-zip. They're completely free and that's how you extract them. So then, you know, you click extract to. I've put mine on my desktop in a folder called modding tool. Okay. And also, if you if you want to support me, seriously, uh, make sure to, you know, subscribe to the channel, drop a like right now. It really helps the video do better. So, you know, dropping a like. So if we can get to like a thousand likes, that'd be amazing on this because this will stay valid unless like a new video comes out and if, or a new modding tool, if a new modding tool comes out, I'll make sure to update this, okay? So the next thing you're like, hey, iVault, where do we get the mods? And here's your answer. So you go over to Nexus Mods, okay? You go to Nexus Mods, Marvel Spider-Man Remastered, and here you'll find all sorts of like amazing mods, okay? So I'm gonna go Let's say uh, we've got a bunch of like we've got 63 new mods today. So this game's gone insane with mods. So let's say hmm, What do we want? We, we, let's go for popular right 30 days. Oh, we've got a bunch of different ones So we could get the amazing spider-man 2 suit, but I'm thinking Let's just get the no way home suit. So there we go. We'll get this one. You're gonna click download. It's gonna be manual Okay, so make sure to do that and I think you're gonna need to create an account over at Nexus mods to download I'm not too sure but that's okay. So you just click download, you wait for it to do its thing, right? There we go. It's 38 megabytes, so it's not gonna take that long, right? It's gonna like be really fast. And once it's done, what you then do, and I mean, this is what I'll do. So I'll just create a new folder. Here, we'll call it mods, okay? And this is fairly simple. So with the new tool, it's so much easier now for anyone new. So here we go. And then you'll, you'll take this file, right? The no way home file. You'll drag it into mods. Okay. Simple, right? And then you'll launch the Spider-Man PC tool. And then you got to find your asset archive folder. And what that is, is I'll show you in a second. So the asset archive folder is in your Spider-Man remastered, uh, file. So the way you access it is you, you do this. Okay. So you, uh, right click here then you go to manage and browse local files okay so there you go and then you'll find it right here this is your asset archive you'll click on it you'll select you'll you just copy and paste that okay and then you'll go back to your tool now that you're here you'll click up here Control v so paste and then you'll select your archive folder which is this save it there we go so now your asset archives are set and you can install mods okay so the way you do it now so you've got all these files you can modify them and it's so easy so you just click mod manager okay and then you click add and to add it you just you know you go to your folder i'm just going to copy and paste it because that's easy okay so you'll go to mods and you see a no way home here you'll click on that your mods added so this is by andre and hippo the No Way Home ending, ending suit, make sure to click this, okay? So you can actually like load it and then you click install mods to game. So now it's installing the mods and then I'll show you in a second that it works. 
So depending on how many mods you're installing, you know, it could take a while. But I'm doing everything from scratch to show you guys that it works. So if you follow everything along, you'll be able to do this too, because I know a lot of people are struggling with this. So there we go. Successfully installed Spider-Man mods. Also, I do want you guys to know that this is my first time doing a tutorial. So, you know, if it seems kind of funny, yeah, that's why. It's, it's my first time making one of these, okay? But I do want to make it as simple as possible for you guys, or as easy as to follow, you know? There's like so many different mods that you can get. You can get mods that change this intro screen to like whatever you want. You can get mods that change the music at the main menu. There's just so many different things. I just wanted to, sh and it, the, the installation process is exactly the same. So you guys don't need to worry or stress about that. So that's the best part about it. Okay, there we go. So we'll click on this one. And to show you that it works, I'll select the uh, Far From Home suit that I used that I showed you at the start of this tutorial. Okay, so there we go. Now I'm going to select the suit. There we go. And boom, you've got your No Way Home suit installed. <laughs> and now you can have yourself some happy gaming, swinging and using suits that should have been added but that's okay because insomniac's gonna add them in the next game but look at how gorgeous this is amazing work absolutely love this and speaking of which in the meantime as well currently we're really close um to being able to successfully import mods as soon as that's done uh, as soon as we can import models everyone that's worked incredibly hard on creating models because this is just a retexture mod that you're able to install right now we'll be able to import full uh, models and that's gonna be so crazy once that's done <laughs> so I can't wait man so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial if you did make sure to drop a like subscribe I truly appreciate it um, it's been long overdue but I just wanted to make sure that everything was properly set so that you guys could actually you know um, use this tutorial otherwise I would have made a tutorial that would have been obsolete in like a day and that nobody would have wanted that you know so <laughs> yeah um, make sure to, like I said, drop a like, subscribe, become a channel member if you wish to support me directly. We're up to 15 members. You can see all of their beautiful faces here on screen right now. Thank you so much. You are the best of you all. Take care of yourselves. I want to reach 100k. <laughs> yeah. Um, watch another video. Bye.